Hello, Shanite. Shanite. Hey. Hi, everybody. Hope you've had a good week. Um, we certainly have, haven't we? We have indeed, yeah. We've had a brilliant week. Nice to be out and about a bit, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, uh, well, David's been out and about, haven't you? I certainly have. Where did you go then? I went down to see my daughter, our daughter. Our daughter, Grandson, please. yeah, our daughter. <laughs> in? In London, all the way to the big smoke. Oh my God. On the bus. He's on, new. on. Out and about. There's a new bus service, rivaling Megabus. It's, well, it's big in Europe. It's called Flixbus. So I went down on that. I'd like to say it was absolutely perfect, but actually it was an hour late. <laughs> so <laughs> well, it you know, but it's, you know, I mean, buses, if you're travelling on the roads, it's going to be busy, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. And yeah. I think after this COVID thing, the roads is just going to be busier and busier because people are trying to avoid, there's going to be more cars on the way. But anyway, anyway it was a good trip. It was a good trip, and, uh, and I uh, had a nice. Do you know what happened when I was away? <laughs> when she wasn't being looked after? Listen. What did you do? Tell everybody what you did. It, well, it was an accident. It was an accident. It was an accident. I had my phone in the back pocket of my trousers and went to the toilet. You're not going to go into all the lorry details, are you? Yes, pulled, pulled my trousers down, got the picture. And my, toy, my, my phone went into the toilet. Anyway, to cut a long story short... So what do you do when your phone goes into the toilet? Said, there's no need to tell everybody that. You pull it out quickly, don't you? Right. Then what do you do? Because it's been in the toilet, you swill it under the tap. I just it? did it momentarily. I was very aware not to let any water into any holes at the phone. However, I didn't dry the phone out properly. And by you can't that, dry it out two properly. days later, when I got the back off the phone... Um, it was still full of toilet water. But not to worry, because I have got a yeah. new phone. You were ready You were ready for an upgrade, weren't you? You were ready for an upgrade, yeah. But it was just so funny. Which I sorted out myself. You did? And, and also, while you were away, um, I did some shopping online. New beads. New beads. Well I got these from a shop called Room Lytham. And if you look on the internet, oh, you get the um, the on, on my blog, I'll put a, a link to it because they sell clothes for a bit larger ladies, okay, but smaller ladies look equally good in them uh, as I do. <laughs> I'm saying nothing here. I'm just, yes, yes, you no, I'm just, yes. <laughs> Now, if you're looking at this, this uh, little video, people from Room Lytham, I'm not wearing the lovely top you sent me uh, but it is gorgeous and um, and really I, I need a different color beads because it's an orange top so another another day I will wear the so am I right in thinking looking at that yeah. with the orange top you need blue beads yes ah, I see. would be nice got an eye for color me or, or black or you know but um, recently I've had some lovely clothes from this company and you you order them online. They've, they've got a little marketing uh, video goes out there twice a week, and they try on the clothes themselves, so you can see what the clothes look like. They're posting on, on them they're, anyway. They're posting little videos every week. They yeah. are. Well, more than I a... think they're doing a fantastic yeah. marketing job. Yeah, absolutely. And um, and I, I, you know, I applaud them for yeah. it. Yeah. I really do. And they've got a lovely shop. If you can see the video of the shop that they've got, they sell all sorts of things, uh, yeah. handbags. And I suppose you've. Umbrellas. It's so personal, and you get nice little Lots signed things. things. You feel as though you know them, don't you? It's so very, it's it's very nice, and uh, you know, you, you feel like you know where you're shopping, rather than the dungarees that I ordered about two months ago. Two months ago now. No, oh, is it? And still haven't come. They'll be in a container somewhere. They will be in a container somewhere. I'm hoping that they do arrive eventually, but they still haven't come. So. So British be careful. On, yes, be careful when you're ordering things from Facebook ads and what have you, um, and and do a bit of research and buy British, buy British all the time. Well, it's easier. Yeah. You can send it back easier. Yeah. Can't you? yeah. Uh, room Lytham. I'll put the link on my blog. It's mm. brilliant. Yeah. Lovely. So what else have we done this week? I've written a poem. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've been. Um, yeah. I've written a poem, which I might, I might. Post up on a on a 
I think you ought to. It's YouTube. a good one. It's a good one. Yeah. yeah? Um, yeah. We'll put a link on your blog to it and everything. Yeah. yeah is that it's what really... you do? And David's made the tea tonight, as you can see. Yes, I've been chefing tonight. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Every time we have pizza, I have to do the cooking. Yeah, that's shame for it, him. Yeah. Shame for yeah. him. It's good. Well, it means turning the oven on. I have to get the temperature right. There's a lot to do. The things to take out of the oven to get the temperature right, yeah, and then you have well, to open the thing. Can I just? Uh, explain that things to take out of the oven because we have a very small house and uh, not a lot of space to put all the cooking pans and everything no, it's only the oven pans so, isn't it yeah. yeah yeah so it's no great deal is it for you to take them out of the oven to put the pizza into the oven but it's an extra yeah, i'm just saying it's not is it know, a whinge? It's, no it's more complicated than you think it's you know it's virgin on chefing is this <laughs> Well, it tastes good anyway. It tastes so, good. It's easy. Yeah. And uh, we went to the pub today. Yeah, lunchtime, didn't we? We inside. had a lunchtime drink in the cock at the end of the, our road. Yeah, smashing. And it was fabulous. Yeah. And they've done it all out in there, you know, and it's really nice. Yeah, and what we've found now it's is nice. that when we go to the so pub lovely. now, everybody's more willing to talk. Yeah. It's as though everybody's had it over a year of not talking. Well, yeah, and when we say been, everybody... You know, you're all seated at a table, uh, but the place is quite cosy. You're quite distant, though. You know, uh, you're not yeah. all crowded. So eh? you're not all crowded. No. And but normally you would have just sat there and had a drink and yeah, and everybody not, else. But now everybody totally, but engages, don't they? Everybody engages. Yeah. It's, 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 it was just delightful. Or maybe it's just us that are that desperate to talk to well, people. Well, we certainly but, but whatever. engage in it conversation, and it was lovely. Yeah. So. We're looking forward to another good week. Next it was so week. good. We're going to do it again. Aren't yes. We? In fact, I think uh, I think David's going to take me out for Sunday lunch. Oh, you got off the air. I was just going to say you were going to take me out. Oh, he's just no. Got out first, come he? on. Oh gosh. Did, Who was it said to who? Would you like to come out for Sunday lunch? It was you. Was it me? Did I say? <laughs> I think oh, you did. Gosh. That's old age for you. I'm slipping. You see. Oh, I fancy I should, a bit of pizza. I should have waited and said, "Oh, I really fancy Sunday lunch. What do you think?" <laughs> Then when she said yes, she did well. Anyway, ah. so you've got mm. to you some. You want to say hello to somebody, don't mm. you? With a mouthful of pizza. I want to say hello to a lady called Jan Otley. Hi, Jan. She's a poet, and she's from Down Beckenham Way. She's a member of the Shortlands Poetry Circle, um, as I am, and she writes some excellent poetry. And um, this week she wrote a triolet. Now, if I can get her permission for next week, I think I might just read it out, this triolet, because it was very, very nice and very good. And uh, Jan, if you're watching this, uh, thanks for your triolet, because, uh, and uh, y you know, I hope you're at the poetry quiz and I hope you're on my team, because... Um, anybody that doesn't know what a triolet is, when you say a poem in a really high-pitched voice, you <laughs> It is not. Oh, it? Oh, right. <laughs> it's a very short poem, but it's quite repetitive in a certain sort of form. Yeah. You don't have to worry about right. it, but you just oh, have to enjoy enjoy the words. Then a yeah. quick uh, hello and happy birthday to our friend Mary Sayer. Happy birthday, yeah. Mary. There is a card coming your way, so let's hope the postman yeah. del delivers on time. Hope you have a really good birthday. Um, and hello to everybody that knows us. Thanks yeah. for watching. Hello to Graham down there in and in Beckenham. Actually, I really want the pizza now. And I, I know. Really want to eat I know. So I don't. You know. I say, know it's it's maybe going a bit cool now. Come so, say bye bye. Now. So I think we ought to say bye bye. Because I've slaved over this. You know. Oh, for goodness <laughs> sakes! How many right. pizzas do we have in a month? How many times do you have to cook in a month? Once, at least once. Well, month, you yeah. know, mm, I don't know. cut it down and we'll cut out the food. We're going to go now. <laughs> Have a good week, everybody. Have a good week, See you everybody. Next time. See you next week. And uh, Look out for the poetry that James posts in poetry and stuff. And, yeah. Uh, yeah. Click and like this video. Uh, spread the good, good news. And we'll, we'll see you back in the shed next week. All be well. God Take willing. care, folks. Take care. Ta Bye. Love to everybody. That was a good one, it. We can jump now, can't we? We can eat now. Yeah. I, I just wanted to mention my cousin, uh, Jim and Pam. Oh, yeah. But um, it's Too a bit late, though, it's a bit late yeah. now, isn't it? Yeah. Did you switch but it off? Not yet. I'll switch it off. All right. Jim and Pam. Hello. Love you. <laughs>